Look at my nails. Yeah, go wax my armpits. Gonna be hair free. Where are you? Gang, gang. This wanna be bad. Said all of my girl in bad. Uh, check it. Mm, it's gonna matter we flex like this. And if we go, you see us flex like that. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Today, guys, I am going to be attempting to wax myself and do my nails. I'm tired of my nails looking dusty and crusty. And I'm tired of having unnecessary hair in places that I don't want hair to be. I was meant to actually have, like, a whole pampering day today. Do a face mask. But I've just been so busy with other things. And there's so much going on in the world right now. I don't even, like, feel myself to be honest with the whole situation with George Floyd Black Lives Matter movement all the stuff that's going on in terms of the riots and things like that there's just a lot going on in the world right now and I've just not been able to like really focus on other things so rather than having a full-on pamper day I'm kind of having a pamper session instead at this point I'm just doing things little things that I think will make me feel a little bit better a little self-care outside of everything that's going on in the world right now so today I'm actually going to attempt to wax my armpits i actually wanted to wax my bikini area as well but the time of the month decided to show up early so i'm basically gonna try and maybe just do the outer regions of the fanny area i'm gonna wax my armpits take it in i got this waxing product from boots recommended by lydia dinga i don't know if you guys follow her since the whole lockdown situation and not being able to see my sugar wax lady or get my laser for my underarm i'm basically having to just try wax myself as someone who's been having laser on my underarms i must say that hair barely grows on my underarms like i can't even remember the last time i had a laser session and the hair under my armpits hasn't really grown but enough for me to wax off today okay i'm gonna get my nails done i'm gonna be using my dipped official diy acrylic set to do my nails after i finish my waxing and this is actually the first time i'm having to actually wax myself i'm really hoping that i don't rip off any skin i don't see blood and also it's my first time putting on acrylic so yeah it's gonna be a first time for both the things i'm about to do right now hopefully everything turns out jiggy okay comes with instructions which is needed instructions are important here is the wax and i think i need to heat this up in the microwave so that it's kind of liquidy right now it's literally like hard i've got two sticks here which i'm going to be using to obviously like spread the wax on there i'm probably going to need some gloves so i don't get wax all over my hands and everywhere and then in the box it also has these post wax calming wipes which i guess i'll put on after i've done the wax to kind of soothe the area i'm gonna also take a leaf out of my sugar wax ladies book and put baby powder on my armpits to get rid of any moisture anything that will stop the wax from sticking stop any issues with me ripping the wax off i read somewhere that you can put specific types of oils as well on the area before you apply the wax but i don't own any of the oils that i saw so i'm just gonna go with baby powder i'm gonna go put some baby powder on and get to waxing go go wax my armpits yeah go wax my armpits go be here every go be here every go be here every go be here every okay i need to i need i need to actually be hair free now okay so i'll be back <laughs> not too long ago came out of the shower so it's all clean i've not put any deodorant on it i've not like used any moisturizers in that area so i'm just gonna put Bruh. oh my gosh that's way too much powder what the hell i didn't even realize that much powder was on my hand what the hell hold on i need to take some of this off i need to take this off hold on i'll be back i'll be back Okay, I think that should be okay. Oh my gosh, I'm already making a mess. Just trying to put powder. <sighs> right. I'm scared. <laughs> this is what the wax is looking like right now. It's too runny. I definitely overheated it way, way, way too much. So I'm going to wait for it to cool down a little bit more. I've got my gloves on. All right, so guys, I'm just reading the instructions on how to apply the wax onto my armpit. It's saying I need to do it in a direction of the hair growth. I'm not too sure what that is for my armpit. 
I don't know. Leave a small amount of wax curling up at the end of the patch to make it easier to remove. So that's the bit I'm gonna use to kind of like pull the wax off. Let the wax cool on my skin for approximately 30 seconds until it's soft and pliable, but no longer sticky to touch. If the wax is left on for too long, more than one minute, it becomes hard and difficult to remove. That scares me. That sounds like some dangerous like, oh my gosh, make sure it's 30 seconds. If it's longer than 30 seconds, if it's more than one minute, then you won't be able to move it. It becomes difficult. It's like a time bomb. If you don't take it off quickly enough, it's gonna blow up and it's gonna peel all your skin off. I don't even know, like, what is 30 seconds to you? Is 30 seconds the same for me? And is 30 seconds the same for you? I don't know. What's 30 seconds? How do I know the temperature is the exact temperature for the 30 seconds that I got to take it off? It's just, it's just so much pressure. I don't know. I don't know. Should I take it off? Should I not take it off? I don't know what's going on right now. I, ju I just don't know. What do I do? Calm down. Get it together. Get a grip. Amina. Okay. All right. Let's check if the wax is ready. We are good to go. The wax is ready. I think I need to actually hurry up before it overly cools down. I've just got to go straight into it. Let me put a little bit more baby powder. Ah! Guys, I'm scared. Come on, Amina. You can do this. Which way should I spread it? This way? Okay, I'm going to spread it up. Oh my gosh, it's actually quite hot. What am I doing? Did I put that on right? I don't know if I put that on right. I don't want to put another layer on top because I don't know if I can do that. I'm not sure if that is a good amount. I've got a little bit here that I can use to kind of pull to take it off. Oh my gosh, I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. Has 30 seconds gone by yet? Has 30 seconds gone by? Should I take it off? It's cooled down. So should I take it off? Should I take it's cooled down? Like it's I don't know if it's been 30 seconds or not. I don't I shouldn't be counting. Actually, I need a stopwatch. Okay, it's not sticky, it's hard. Oh yeah, yeah. Right, so Lydia flicked it like that to get a bit off. Okay, I need to pull it now. <sighs> One, I should spread it. I'm meant to spread it. Okay, let me spread it a bit like that. Okay, <sighs> help me Jesus. Okay, oh, oh, oh. Should I pull it off? I'm gonna pull it off. Guys, <laughs> Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Right, let me pull it, let me pull it. Okay, one, two, three. Bruh. It didn't come off. <laughs> What the hell? Okay, I need to go back in. Maybe I should do it from the bottom. Okay, I'm gonna do it from the bottom because this bit here is already lifting. All right. One, two, three. Oh my God. I actually pulled it off. Oh my gosh. It actually took the hair off. Oh my gosh. There's still like little bits on there. I'm just gonna pull them off actually not as painful as I thought it was gonna be. Maybe because I don't have a lot of hair and my hair's quite thin, but there's still hair on there. I'm gonna have to go again. There's still like little thin bits of hair still in there. I'm gonna have to go again. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Wow! Okay, the wax has actually completely gone solid again, so I'm gonna have to go and reheat it. What? That is the fattest mosquito I've ever seen in my life. What the hell? It better not come inside here. Okay, I thought so. I'm actually so shocked by how easy that was to take it off. It really wasn't as painful as I thought it was gonna be. Bearing in mind that I don't actually have that much hair and my hair is not like super, super thick. I'm gonna go reheat this and do another layer and then I can move on to this arm. Ah! I'm gonna go again on the same arm. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so messy. Yeah, I definitely didn't apply it very smoothly. Let me leave it to cool down. Cool down. Hey, hey, cool down. Hey, hey, cool down. Hey, hey, cool down. Okay, I think it's cool down now. Ready to pull off. Pull up, pull up, pull off. Get an edge to hold on to. The way that I've not spread this evenly at all. Okay, I'm gonna pull it. I'm gonna pull it. I'm gonna pull it. Ah! Hold on, wait. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, let me spread my armpit a bit. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. One. Two, three. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. I, I can't get a grip. Hold on. <laughs> what the? I've done this already. I don't know why it's even scarier the second time round. Okay, come on. Come on, girl. One, two, three. Damn. I can't believe that it actually proper pulls the hair out from the root. Whew. Look at my armpit. Still a little bit here that I need to try and pull off. 
Okay. Oh, I can't believe I'm actually doing this. This is actually so much fun. <laughs> I'm gonna use the post wax calming oil wipe to just wipe that area and then I'm gonna move on to my other armpits but guys that wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be at all this came out way better than I thought it was going to my armpit looks so smooth and I think I managed to get all the hairs off I can't see any hair at all look at my armpit yo look how small my armpit is what yes I'm gonna be taking all my selfies like this. My armpit is serving. Okay, get into it. I am going to go and reheat this once again. It's gone solid again. Then I'm gonna go ahead and do my other side. I'm just gonna see if I can do my like very outer bikini line area. Well, what it happened was I couldn't do it guys i could not do my bikini line it was too painful i was like no you know what i got time for that i'm gonna leave it to my sugar wax lady guys you will not believe as you can see from the clock behind me it's literally almost two o'clock in the morning and i'm about to do my nails yep the pampering continues i'm gonna do my nails look at that girl looking all trip 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 looking all trip trip Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Park, me and Natanya. I've just been feeling really, really down. Natanya's been feeling really, really down about everything going on. So we needed kind of a day to kind of get away, let our hair down, get some fresh air, get out of the house. Just, you know, take a moment. We're on bikes at the moment. There are bikes that are provided that you can pay for to use and ride around London. Guys, check out my nails that I did. Look at my nails, guys. Look at my nails. Look at Natanya leaving me. Look at her, look at her close up you'll see all the bits where I kind of wasn't very neat but I think this was actually quite a good outcome for a first time DIY acrylics application you know what I mean so yeah they look cute they look cute don't forget you guys can get 20% off by using my discount code with dipped official but yeah I'm loving my nails y'all it's so cute <laughs> Natana's left me so I'm gonna I'm gonna get going but um, I'm not a hundred percent secure on this bike because it's been ages since I've rode a bike Obviously, you will never forget how to ride a bike But just like the confidence level of just making sure that I don't fall and smash my face on the concrete So yeah, I'm gonna take my time. Natanya's just dashing off and doing her thing But yeah, we're gonna try and enjoy the day. Just take a break from everything Have a bit of a woosa relax have a bit of a self-care moment and just enjoy being outside in the park obviously the Rona is still about 
out so I ain't really trying to be around too many people but this is what Victoria Park is looking like right now it's super super pretty there's like a massive waterfall right there there's quite a few people here but everyone's social distancing and it's not like super 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 packed so um yeah i'm actually wearing a skirt so i had to tie my jacket around my waist because <laughs> fanny to the wind and all that <laughs> guys i'm trying to get this to like be positioned so y'all can see us riding chair look at her with a figure eight oh bad 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 watch her wine with a silhouette oh na 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 look at her with a figure eight oh bad 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 see a chival dj drop the bass Hey guys, Natanya is now the narrator. Alright, let's go. Where are you? Gang, gang! <laughs> guys, I'm trying not to drop the camera. My mum is literally, look how far behind she is. Look at her with a figure eight. Oh, bad, bad, bad. Watch her wine with a silhouette. I'm poofed, I'm sweating. I'm so hot right now. Let go, let go, let go. We're gonna okay. the other way now. Come on, then. Okay. 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 Ok